yesterday cba has registered a fresh case against ysr cp rebel mp raguram krishnam raju from andhra pradesh in a 237 crore bank fraud case this case has been registered by a, the cbi on a complaint filed by the deputy general manager sbi chennai against seven person that includes this mp also mp2 however mr raju said apcm jagan mohan reddy is behind this affront who is mr raguram krishnam raju he is mp elected from andhra pradesh from cm jagan mohan reddy's own party ysrcp he is a rebel mp now and for for quite for some time he is up in arms against his own party cm jagan he recently raised his voice against cm jagan for increasing conversion activities in the state under his leadership and vehemently protested against a series of attacks on hindu temples and the burning of temple chariots that took place last year mp raguram krishnam raj also sought protection uh, from physical fearing physical attacks from his own party men so accordingly home ministry has provided him security last year august he worked together with bjp andhra bjp leaders in protest against the cm's dubious role in the mass christian conversions in the state and increased attacks on hindu temples now if you are wondering how the cbi which is obviously under the pm modi and the central government's control can book a case against this popular pro hindu mp from andhra pradesh this is all the politics on the other hand cm jagan is at present known for his popular support to modi and bjp at the central government andhra pradesh congress leaders always alleges that jagan is the bjp's most trustworthy ally and jagan voted in support of nrc with his 21 22 mps in lok sabha and 6 mps in rajya sabha This is how our BJP plays politics with the CM Jagan's friends and foes. This is some opinion. Let us recollect what happened 2019. I would like to take you back. A popular industrialist from Andhra Pradesh and TDP MP Mr. Sujana Chowdhury defected to BJP and supported BJP in voting government bills. He too was under the central scanner for his 6,000 crores bank fraud case. and he got full immunity i believe now this is real politics now but there is a catch here bjp's ideological enemies like chief minister mr jagmohan reddy uddhav thakre of maharashtra state and others are fulfilling their ideological dreams by applying intimidating tactics on the central government bjp ruled government and bjp leaders on the other hand unfortunately bjp is caving into these pressures and betraying their own hindus bjp is now haplessly watching the mass and illegal conversions activities that are going on in full swing in ap and anti hindu activities that is going on in maharashtra as well because of political compulsions bjp is openly supporting jagan in a hapless condition situation but may be hoping that the god will give hindus justice but they were not able to give provide justice for hindus i mean god the supreme court may in coming days tackle jagan with the pending corruption cases against the chief minister